Hi, my name is Timothy Lemoyne of TimothyLemoyne.com and welcome to part four of building our one bird birdhouse. Thanks for tuning in. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to take this remaining piece of wood and make your roof pieces. Stay tuned. So this video takes us back over to the table saw, but this time things are a little bit different. This time, our blade's at an angle. This is gonna allow the two pieces to come together and form a peak. Nothing really different as far as technique goes. You're still passing your board all the way through. Speaking of which, the remaining board should be approximately 24 inches long before you pass it through. I'm gonna do that next. Check it out. After your board hits the floor, two things should be true. One, you've got an angled cut on your board, and two, you have one little scrap piece that you pulled off the saw. Over to the miter saw next, guys. Oh no, did I say or miter saw next? I meant we gotta measure and mark. Look at sheet six. Sheet six will tell you what length that both roof pieces get cut to. I like to measure from both ends of the board. It saves me time. If you've got a different method, that is certainly fine. Technique wise though, we're still scribing lines and marking X is where the saw blade goes. And now as always, don't forget to spam your name and the part name all over these things, you guys. <laughs> That is it for part four. It's a super short one. All we had to do is get our roof pieces cut. Want to know if yours are done right? Check it out. If you look at them together, they're going to form the 612 roof pitch. That's what we're looking for on this. Hope you've enjoyed the video. As always, if you haven't done it yet, be sure and hit like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.